Well, hello everyone. My name's Bill Southern and these are my Nugget Shooter Journals. We're kind of on vacation right now. I was up by Franconia hunting meteorites. Did pretty darn good. Got uh, about six of them, I think it was. One iron and uh, the rest were chondrites. Very cool. And we're fixing to have lunch. Riddle on the stove. Cooking some fine looking burgers for my fine looking woman. Hi y'all, I'm in heaven here. This is such a beautiful place. And here's why. Are you ready for this? So pretty. How about that? We are at Lake Havasu and we're in the uh, Crazy Horse RV Park. It's a nice park, reasonably priced. No sewer hookup, but there's a uh, little truck that comes around twice a week and picks up uh, your waste if you need it done. And way over there, the part of Havasu. This is beautiful. We're going to hang out here a couple days and just enjoy ourselves. I'll take you down to the water here in a little bit. But yeah, paradise in the desert, my friends. Paradise in the desert. Yeah, we got neighbors pretty close on both sides, but you know what? It's an RV park. Nice breeze off the lake. It's good fishing in that lake, too. We got a bunch of little coots swimming around. That's coot with the C-O-O-T. It's a type of uh, water bird there. Duck, whatever. I don't think they're a duck. I think coot's something different than duck because they dive. So they're diving birds. They dive down and catch stuff. You'll see one bob back up in a minute. They went, there went come up one and there went down one. How about that? But they feed off the bottom and feed on minnows and such. So anyway, we're gonna have some lunch and uh, hang out for a little bit and I'll take you down to the water. And we're gonna take Bruno down there and see how he feels about a lake. I'll be back. Now you just got to understand, water is a pretty amazing thing to a guy that lives in Arizona and has lived here a long time. We don't have a lot of spots with a lot of water. Look what's going on here, man. Look at that parasail up there. Hope you can see that. That's pretty cool. God, look at this lake. We're getting close to sunset. And uh, I told you I'd share that with you. And we're going to go down and see the water here. Hmm. That guy's just whipping around in that parasail. Got boats everywhere. They do spring break here, too. And I tell you what, it gets pretty wild during spring break. Pretty wild indeed. But you can camp right along here too. This is a cool, really cool RV park. Crazy Horse Campground right there. You hear music out there? <laughs> we need to go down to the water here. Yeah, I know. It's supposed to be about gold detecting and stuff, but you know what? We do a lot of different stuff. There's a lot to see in Arizona. And we got all these reeds, cattail parts washed up here. This is the natural beach. Now you get down there in the sand, they actually dump sand on the beach in some of these places, from the sand dunes. But there's no mistake in the fact that that's water. Yep. And I can hear music coming from across the water. Look at that. That would be so cool. <coughs> Excuse me. He's being pulled by that blue boat. And look at this. Paradise in the middle of the desert. There's some cool rocks in here. Can't see much on them because of all the, the coating of other crap. But we got clam shells and stuff in here too. And a lot of these are zebra mussels. And uh, they got here by accident. And they're a bad deal around here. We're fixing to have a sunset. Hmm. 
Now I'll tell you something about Lake Havasu area. It's beautiful. Right now we're in March and it's just a wonderful day. It's about 78 right now. Hardly any wind. But yesterday the wind was blowing 40 to 50 miles an hour. <laughs> it was not much fun at all. And the big deal is, I'll tell you something here in the summer, they see some of the hottest temperatures in the whole state of Arizona here during the summer. And all the way up to Bullhead City and in that area by Laughlin, Nevada. It gets hot. And we're talking 117, 124, and higher. But I'll show you some of the cool rocks in here, but like I said, they're all coated um, with an algae type material or this is white stuff which I'm sure is uh, just calcium carbonate and mud. You can rub it off with your thumb if you look. So you really can't see. But you get down in here a little bit. There's actually some pretty cool rocks in here. A piece of jasper. And a lot of other stuff in here. You can actually uh, walk around here and find some pretty cool stuff. Even a little bit of agate sometimes. Pretty cool. But I just thought I'd give you the pre-sunset look. And uh, as this goal passes, I'll give you the sunset look here in a minute. I'm just having a blast out here. Everybody's coming back now. It's getting late. Parasail guys, way over here by our camp now. And you got fishermen out there trying to catch the darn fish through all this. Yeah, cool. So that's Look right here. Hey, you can rent these darn rides here, man. Wouldn't that be a trip? And you're pulling it with that boat down there. I don't know if you can see it. It's off in the distance, but how cool is that? Yeah, sometimes life can be a whole lot of fun. Take a break from gold hunting or meteorite hunting for a few minutes and you find out there's just a whole lot of other things to do in Arizona, in the Southwest. Yeah. So, I know I keep saying here comes the sunset and I put something else on, but here comes the sunset. Bam, there it is. And we got boats. Yeah, I know. But you know what? If you got an open mind, everybody's allowed to have fun. And that boy probably spent a lot of money on that boat. And he's going to drive that boat. By golly, if I had that boat, I'd drive it too. It's pretty fast. Mountains are turning purple. Charles are barking. I'm telling you right, right now, that that boat's got some beef in the basket. <laughs> that thing just are roaring. Okay, here he goes. Sunset. You know, a fitting ending to a great day. I got no problem with hearing that boat. I ain't the kind of guy in an RV park go, oh my god, a noisy boat on the lake. You know what the key is here? I got the lake, and I think that boat's pretty cool. I've got to a motorcycle for most of my life, so uh, yeah, a lot of power right there. Look at him go.
Look at this sunset, though. You top this anywhere in the USA, my friends. Oh, he's winding her down. <laughs> yeah. Okay, across that river is California. Well, it's a lake there, but it's California over yonder. I'm not sure what mountains those are. I really should have looked it up so I could tell you, but I didn't. And that's about it for this video for the night. Mighty big catfish in this here lake. Stripers, man, they get big ones here. I mean, some of them just 15, 20 pounders, easy, and over. Look at the color on that water. So, if you like these videos, want to see a few more, like, subscribe, and uh, smash that bell for now. Now you shoot her out on a beautiful March evening in Lake Havasu City, Arizona. whole lot of reasons I live here. This is one of them. Yep. See ya.